gentlemen, and as always, thank you for watching. Today we've been called by a customer that has a D6 dozer that's stuck. I do not know anything other than the location and that it is a D6 dozer that's stuck. They did try to get it out with an excavator last night and they were unsuccessful. They didn't say what size excavator, uh, but the excavator is still on site. We may have to utilize it uh, either to help dig out or uh, as a dead man. Don't know yet. We will see when we get there. Here we go. Excavator. So I'm gonna keep going. Somebody behind me waving me on. There she is. How are 
Sarah, sir. Well, not all right. But well, had better days for sure, but. Yeah, last night we won't bust it if you want to tie to that chain, but whatever you want to do. Your dad's saying something about maybe you can ask for a dead man. Maybe, maybe. Woo, wow, she down in there, isn't she? Yeah, we had him come. Well, it was way over there, and then Terry brought him back, and then he it just kept getting deeper. I said, we ain't doing no good. Yeah, it needs a lift and a pull at the same time, don't it? Let me get a closer look here. We set the blade down in there last night, just keep the engine keep up. Keep it from, yeah, yeah okay. God dog, it still is. We can get the blade back out of it, but God dog, it, he couldn't pull it. She's down pretty good. No doubt about that. Yeah. Just walking here, it don't feel that bad, but you can see it's just soup. Yeah, they want to put a dry hole through here. I swear, he ain't going to get that through here. Yeah, ain't nothing but soup. Okay. What? Uh, that's tied to the drawbar. Okay. She's she hooked good. I just didn't know what grade. Uh, oh, that's a railroad chain. You won't bust that one. Yeah, we can pull on it. Yeah, sometimes trying to fight them just gets them stuck even deeper. Yeah, so then the water, I said, Terry, we're getting water started to come up around that motor. It's throwing it out. And I said, Terry, we better quit. So I, we set the blade back down and right. just to keep that engine up. But once we lift him, I mean, we can pick the blade back up. And, uh, okay. So. I'm Ron, by the way. Dale. Dale, nice Ron. to meet you, sir. I know the name. I work with Sean down at the yeah. bank all the time. Well, so. heck yeah. Oh. Um, yeah, she's a character that girl. <laughs> and, you know, see, she went by us today. We was filling in ditch over on that new road they put here on uh, the, from Scott City to Kelso. Yep. And I said, hey, when you see a farmer working, you're supposed to wave. I didn't even see you. <laughs> she likes to talk, don't she? Yes, she does. I love her, though. Heck yeah, good woman. <sighs> All right. Well, I could use what a swamper here. I don't have any choice. I'm gonna have to be off the road and in this field. Yeah. Do you own this field? Yeah. Okay. You're okay with me being in the field then? Okay. Because I'm gonna. I'm gonna need to be in as straight a line as I can get with it. Yep. And I'm gonna have to lift and. Uh, I don't know. We may have. May have to do like Dad said and use the excavator as a dead man to run another line off of. That's what he was saying. We'll give it a tug first and see. Okay. It's hard to determine the uh, exact resistance on something like that when it's all yeah. that far down. Oh yeah, that su that suction's that suction's tough. But we're going to give it the. Good old Southeast Missouri try here.
like getting her off road like this, but we're gonna have to. No, I did not do my three horn toots. I have a backup alarm. I just want to get in here, get lined up with the dang thing. Too bad right there. We'll get you undone. I may have to have some help getting out. Yeah, we'll get you under. It's coming. I'm surprised you get back before you did. I'm surprised you pulled back up. Well, I've got full lockers on it. Yeah, I mean, it's not a horrible truck. We get in there with something like that. We wouldn't have come in here. Well, this, pull in here. this thing's about 72.5. Yeah. So okay. she's she's pretty heavy. Yeah, she is heavy. But I, I raised my lift axle, which helps give me more traction on the drives. Well, yeah. We've all... Yeah. We'll get her out. Yeah. At least it hadn't, it's been dry this yeah, week. At least it hadn't. Yeah, it was muddy when Rick and I tried it. Yep. And he couldn't even get to me, so I said, let's quit. Well, then, Terry last night, I seen him at a ball game. Well, we can get, I can her, I'll get him out. Yeah. Should have left it alone. It was back where it was. That's right. We, we tried. That's all that matters. I'm gonna, I know it probably won't do it, but I'm gonna get one line down to it, doubled up, and get some pressure on it, and have you in it, and see if we can walk it back a little bit. If that don't work, we'll throw another line on it, and maybe the excavator. Okay. But for right now, if I get one line on it, it doesn't look like it's in the soup too much. Uh, if we can get that two or three feet of that track back up on this clay, on. you ought to come on up out of there. It's his ground, it's coming. Oh, Gary wants to put a drive hole. We had to get it started by June 6th or June 4th, they ain't going to pay on it. Uh oh. God darn it. Government project. Yeah. Yep. I can carry what you want to carry this. Yeah, I just need to run the snatch block down there. All right. Do what? That's a big cable. Yeah, it is. For what we do, we need a big cable. Yes, I agree. You never know what kind of predicament you can get like this one. Until we keep the cable lubed. Yeah, you do. <laughs> Heck yes. All right, let me walk up a little bit. We're just about there. Yeah, I think we're here. That chain reach this far. All right. Yeah, because he, he pulled and the sparks flew and he never did bust that old chain. That's a railroad chain. It, it'll hold. 
I'm gonna say I've got grade 100 yeah, these are five good. eighths. And he's real tight. I know good to have. That fit, that's a half inch. Feels like half inch. Yeah, we can just hook it here if you want to hit with that. Yeah. That'll work. Let me pull her up. Oh, I was just gonna give you yeah, where where you had some slack. Yeah, I thought heck there's that good. Yeah. Let me go get my remote. All right. If you want to fire the machine yeah. up. I don't think a double line is going to bring it out, but we'll try it. and easy. Keep going with it. Doing good. Looking good.
his hand. Can you turn it? Can you turn it this way a little or no? Okay, all right. Drop the drop the boom down. I'm just dropping the boom down. Ready to go again. It's, I'm moving it without him, but. If he can help, that makes it a whole lot easier. Oh, oh that looks a lot better. That looks a lot, lot better. Finish wrapping everything up and get out of here. No injuries, just a little bit of mud, fun in the mud. Good bit of mud. And that uh, water, I've seen water come, but that's from him sitting in that water. Yeah. Oh, yeah. But the daggum radiator got mud so far up. Now. Oh, I wouldn't doubt it. Yeah, we gotta clean that all out. And we'll see that. Oh, he's out of here. I'm proud of that, Dad. Well, at least you can say you did start the project. Yeah. <laughs> That's all we had to do. That's all K7 we did start. Well, we had the excavator on another job over France and Blease and a couple other people, and then we brought it in until I got hung up, and then we're going to take trees out with it. You ain't going to do nothing in there. No, uh uh. Just stay out of that mud hole, and the only thing we can do maybe if we get farther down and drain it. Right. With excavator, but we got it may take a mini too. I don't know. We'll get we'll get something done. We're not gonna pull it out. We're gonna plant beans. I'm gonna say, can you uh, can you dam it up here? Yeah, uh, be, if you dam it up and then uh, dig it out further out. down, let it let let it drain. Dig your drain out. Yep, that's what we're Let her dry out. Yeah. Maybe. Yeah, that'd be the only thing we can do. I mean, God, dog. There's a pond and a winter spring. I guess running up here. Gotcha. I know it's an old pond. All right. <laughs> yep. Let me get my spades lifted. And yeah, see what you can do. If not, we'll get the old escalator up on the road. He ain't gonna hurt that black house. I got all eight locked in, so 
hopefully I can walk right up out of it. If I leave that lift axle. The only thing that might hang me up is that uh, those front set of outriggers. I can see where they drug coming in. But if I go in at an angle, I might be able to clear it. Yep, I'll call that to you. Gonna have to let the air ride come up for a minute. Is this is rotator yoga? Yes, sir, it is. That's what I thought. I've seen it advertised on TV, but I don't even know how to do it. Uh, yep, that's what I said. Just We'll just let the air ride come up and it'll... Uh, the other one's free. It come up okay. Just takes a minute for the air ride to settle back. Yeah, ah, there we go. That was we had had part of the ground pulling back. That's what gave us our bite. Bet you had some tension. Well, our brother Bill always said you don't want to slip in tracks. Oh. You know he said put her in third and just let her keep easy. Yep. Well, you did you did good there. That's, yeah, yeah, we, we worked real good together there. Dang, now we got her out of there. All oh, Rick will be happy. I tell him that. Well, he wanted, I should have called y'all too. They would Paul said, "Well, they can come look at it and see about it." Well, then hell, they, they're busy. Oh yeah, well, that's all right. I Rick, I, when I called Paul today, I said, "Paul said, man, I got a whole crawler in, and we got a blocking line." He said, "I don't know. We're going to have a pull." I said, "I said, ah, heck, I'll well, just go up there to." He mentioned you always. He said, "Go get them yeah. guys to do it." And I said, "Hell yeah." Yeah, we we work with Paul and Marty all the time too. Good so yes. they're good people. Yes, they are. They're good people. We we've worked with them for years and years and years. Yeah. Well, let me get up on the road here and we'll. Yeah, and then, yeah, and then how about, I'm going to pay you uh, either I can come by or whatever you want. Okay. Me to do. Figure bill up. I'll be done by Monday or Tuesday. I'll that, that'll that'll work. Yeah, just just come to... just come by one day yeah, next we're week. Gonna, we're going to plant beans Monday or Tuesday. We're going to rain Wednesday. So Wednesday be better for me. We know where you live. Yep. <laughs> all right. That, that'll, I'll appreciate it. It's all good. It's all good. Don't worry about it. It's all, all right. good. Well, good deal. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate your job. We do. Uh, I love. I should have called earlier. I love doing this stuff. I do, I really I do. do. Well, that's good. I mean, it just made me how much that thing pulled. Oh, yeah. But your dad said we had to use that excavator. I said, well, I'll be over there. Yeah, when he said you had to use the excavator and you tried to pull it out, that had me concerned. Yeah. I was I was really concerned when you said the excavator wouldn't wouldn't move it. Well, what it did, it just kept sliding that thing downhill. Yeah. And, and now I see why, because it's on a downhill slope. Yeah, and Terry would set that bucket in there and he'd curl it, you know, and it would it'd hold that machine and, and right. it'd, it'd pull me back a little bit, not enough. And that got into more mud. Didn't well, you, see that? you had gravity working against the excavator and you had the suction working against the, the dozer, so. Heck yeah, she was in there. All right, let me All get right. up on the road here. I turned my uh, lift axle off. I may have to put that pusher axle down anyway, because it'll help lift that up. It just takes my traction away. Yeah, but I mean, it looks like it's a bag in here. If you go forward angle, I'll get this crawler. I can move this crawler. Oh, it's, it's, that's what hung you right here. Yeah. You got there, that hung you. I've got traction. Let me put that lift axle back right. down, yeah. see if that brings that up enough to where I don't have to worry about that. But I'm moving. Yeah, you are. As long as I don't fill my cleats up. Oh, 
Oh yeah. We're good now. Just needed that extra little lift. Heck yeah, that did it. Hell yeah. All right, sir. Thank All you. Right, thank Appreciate you. it. You bet. Have a good day. You too, sir. All right. We will. I'll be up and take care of you. Okay. It's all good. Somebody's got a job cleaning up, don't they? Yeah, let this stuff dry and it suits out a lot better. Me <laughs> right, and Paul last night had to dig underneath that drawbar, and I mean, it was. Oh. You can't really shovel that stuff out of there. I know it. It's this old Mississippi soup. Yeah. Yeah, once she dries it, it's better. Yeah. Thank you, sir. God bless. Thank you. Have a good day. Woo! Well, doggies. All right. There she is. Now I'm unstuck. Both of us unstuck. Everybody unstuck. It's all good. All right. As always, thank you for watching and God bless.